break and I'll tell you. Please. No? I can't run that. Can somebody come up to assist us for that of the American National Anthem?
Well, Lord G, your professor, Oswake, for Imo State, lay your hand. Can you hear me? No, but the Lord G, you hear me? I'm on your power, man. I'm on your territory, this year. Well, Lord G, you're on your territory, this year. Well, Lord G, you're on your territory, this year. Ego mistake. Omo ni akani pia. We watch it. We get a professor Sadobe. She dealt her. Only a woman made the first premier of the Northern States. That is for Sadobe. We watch it. We watch it. Chotonye. You go to only the first state. You go to China. Because the only the first state in the bar. Love you. 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 Love Is anybody from a Bible? A little me. I saw a dear. No, as a woman, you can't give you no. No, 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 don't worry. I saw a dear. So, so, no, 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 State, can I get cross river? Whatever, yes. The guy is in the house. Okay, get it from. Give it to him. No, 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 no. Get it. Oh, you all go, huh? No granddaughter, did. And you're going to want to move from nowhere. That was a popular word. Sabotua. 
as at last week in the Roman Catholic Church, I witnessed about two hours. Who was telling me that our leader will not be here? I didn't care. Sabotuas, shame unto them. Sabotuas, shame unto them. We are a living witness. Ladies and gentlemen, at this point in time, please permit me to welcome to the microphone our zona coordinator, Eziata, Ezimua, Muna Jim Saga, Leti Obama, Biko Kubunaga. Thank you, Mazi. IPOB! the children of God are here. So my name is Munachim Saga, like he said, and I am going to give a little opening statement. I can't believe I'm doing this. I'm the, the most shyest person. <laughs> okay, I want freedom for my people. Yes.
They often make a fortune from the misery and pain of their people. Some of them even get to the extent of calling themselves the elite, and they have the audacity to call their own people misgrants. And as a result, ashamed to identify and team up with their people. Unlike this group of persons, Mazi Nandi is everything to everyone. He freely identifies with his people, irrespective of their social class. Yes. He is even ready to be labeled a miscrant along with his people. Mm-hmm. You know he was asking for a t-shirt that says miscrant. So he's, he's willing to be labeled a miscrant for his people. They willingly obey his command without being bright or good job. A case study is the annual 30th of May sit at home in Biafra land. It is a known fact that the Biafra people are Republicans and very democratic in their approach to life. So when you see them committed to a man, he must have won their hearts. Yes, sir. Freedom of speech includes the freedom to defend people, to offend people by telling the truth. Why? Because the truth will set you free. But first, you will have to be pissed off, unfortunately. This is the approach Mazen Khan has used to wake up the people of Biafra. He made us go back to whom we are. The people of the truth, the people is all Ubuntu. Truth is life. He also made us begin to see and project into the future. He warned us about the dangers ahead, and as a result, helped to bring us together into one big IPOB family. The work of Mazen Nandi through the past few years speaks for itself. For over 50 years, that is, since the Biafra genocide. In 1967 to 1970, more than 3.5 million women and children were gruesomely and mercilessly massacred. It has been very difficult to bring the Biafra people together since then. However, today, all that has all that has changed as we have we are here present under one roof, representing every different part of Biafra land, working together towards the freedom of our people. This indeed is a great achievement. As a female Biafra freedom fighter, I have learned a lot. Part of which that the reason Africa was left in that continent for over 400 years is that women were not given the rightful place in the government and the leadership, like in other continents. (laughs) Policies and decisions were made on their behalf without allowing them to participate in the process of that decision making. How would you effectively represent those that you cannot comfortably identify with? Rwanda, a nation that suffered genocide as Biafra is today being built up at a very fast pace. Our government is committed to ensuring equal rights for women and men without prejudice to the principle of uh, agenda, um, without prejudice to the principle of uh, gender equality in nation building. The 2019-2013 Rwanda parliamentary election ushered in an unprecedented record-breaking 64% of seats for female candidates, making Rwanda the top country for women in politics. Although we are yet to be fully restored, I believe that IPOB will get more female participation in women in politics. in the language, women will be treated equally. So to every government freedom fighter in Brazil, collective future is very important. Yes. Therefore, my counsel for us is to see the project as a communal project, not a private business. It is not about me. It is not about you. It is about the people of Biafra. Therefore, there is no need for necessary competition. Just recognize your brothers and sisters' gifts and allow them to work for Biafra. Every Biafra is uniquely gifted. The challenge then is recognizing and maintaining your name in use of your gifts. Also, it is critical for us to boycott every wrong association. The people attack Boys Club for the purpose of this presentation. And the only hang around visionary people and dreamers who will make your dream a reality. And also boycott those selling our rights and the future of our children for their notoriety and their political interests. How do we identify them? They are the ones that can freely speak about freedom in the zoo and they will not be arrested. Yes. That's how you know who is against your freedom. Yes. Therefore, I'm calling on you 
children of Tupo Dikabiyama, children of God for in case for our brothers and sisters, especially women, to rise up and be counted towards restoring a nation that will leave a heritage for our children. Finally, having said all this, I urge everyone to press on to this price that is worth fighting for, a free and fully restored Biafra nation, a super nation of all nations, flowing with milk and honey, that will make life easy for our future generation. All day, Biafra! There's no here. Yes, 
Lord. Without the Hamadike, there is no Biafra. Yes. yes. For what is happening to us, we must always arm and squash them. Yeah. Respectfully, all our elders from every part of this world, we recognize you. All our youth, you are going to hear the elders talk to you. Because you will take over. We cannot allow the Fulanese that do not develop anything to destroy us. It will never happen because we're working and Chubakama is behind us. All of you that are here today are ordained and blessed. Our country is ours. I just want to thank you for coming. I just want to heartily thank you for coming. What can I say now? Oh, only general Kumarisi, Onye, Nasa Brony Borokia, Ule Mania, I told you so for all. Macaulay, I'll be home. Onye, I never. Onye, do you have one year? Only I judge you. Every chain in the China, I am what they are. Our elders, our women are charged like our able Houston Zomu Coordinator spoke. In IPOB, we work respectfully with the leadership of IPOB on that Nandi channel. Therefore, we are here to humbly thank you again. I will come back and talk to you some other time. I'm the National Coordinator of USA. The National Coordinator of USA. Texas is lucky to have me in Indian state. I have our brothers and sisters who are here in Houston doing the necessary job. And I acknowledge all of them. Whether I call you name or not, we honor you, we thank you, we ask you to continue because history, history will treat you right. History will treat you right and Chuka Bama will continue to bless you for what you do. All you do need to sacrifice. We do it because of our unborn children, our future generation, our elders, and us. We will sacrifice everything sacrificable. We will. We will bring it to you. We are ready to work with those who want to work. We are not ready to work with those who just talk. Or Hadike has done, or Hadike has done, done. That's why we follow him. Yes. I will fail to introduce our state coordinator, who is here in the house. Mazi Chirobe, please identify yourself. I wanted to make sure that any time you need help, you see these three people, but it's not us. You see our members. We have the registrar. You put your name there. And you put your number there. And you put where you reside, not your home address, anything of that nature. We just want to, if you want us to talk to you, we will come and we serve you. We are here to serve you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll talk to you. God has written today in this book of life. For those of us who are here today, 
we will all live to witness the proclamation of
of our leaders, we are asking our Almighty God, who has continued to retain your life, who has continued to keep you, you will only to see the proclamation of this great nation. My Jesus! Yeah.